A 26-year-old Kansas City woman was arrested this week. Apparently, she had a child with someone who'd shown up at her work. Interestingly enough, this wasn't a normal office job as you may think. Jennifer Burroughs was an assistant pathologist employed by Jackson County Medical Examiner Services. Basically, she performed autopsies. So this woman, Mrs. Burroughs, had conceived a child back in 2017. She carried this child to term, giving birth to a son January 7, 2018. After some time, the police investigation found that the now child of Mrs. Burroughs was fathered by a 57-year-old veteran from Texas. Wow. Crazy, right? He happened to be traveling through Jackson County when he had a fatal car accident, ending up on the table in front of Mrs. Burroughs. <laughs> somehow, <laughs> I don't know how, but somehow the police were informed that this young woman may have been sexually abusing corpses. That's right. Probably her YouTube page. I don't know. Right? That would have been weird. Suspicions of her actions seemed to go unnoticed for a while, but eventually somebody caught on. <laughs> really? <laughs> Someone caught on? <laughs> Can this woman not find a living, breathing human being that can satisfy her needs. How do you get to the point when you look at a corpse and you say, man, I want to hit that. Mm, yeah. I mean, ooh, right? Seriously, that's disgusting. <laughs> but obviously it happens. Allegedly, Mrs. Burrell sexually abused more than 60 male corpses, ranging in the age from 17 to 71 years old. Did you hear that? <laughs> 17. Is that not considered statutory rape? <laughs> or because the young man was dead. Maybe that just doesn't count. How does that not count? I didn't know this, but apparently there are no current laws against having sex with a corpse. Makes you think. How is that not a thing? Maybe there just haven't been enough cases to make actions like that illegal? That could be. If not, then maybe this could be that moment when we as a nation can make such a law. Let's talk to Donald Trump. <laughs> Donald Trump? Maybe. Honestly, I didn't think a male could perform after death. Of course we can. <laughs> Says the male. There we go. As of now, Mrs. Burroughs faces 158 charges, including indecent treatment of a corpse, indecent exposure, possession of illegal drugs, and being a whore. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Even dead people. Wow. Okay. So this raises the question, what were the drugs used for? What types of drugs was she on? Or was she using them on the corpses? Did the drugs used to make sexual interaction possible? You think so? Mm -hmm. If these drugs were used on the corpse, wouldn't that be assault? Or wouldn't assault be added to those charges? That's a good question. That may be only for living victims, though. That is something to think about. It is. Let's not have sex with corpses. That's just gross. That's okay. a good idea. Let's not. People, stay away from the morgue. If you're horny, there's a hooker on the corner close to you. That's right. For fair prices during the current <laughs> pandemic. So get out there while you I haven't can. really been out, but I've heard. Okay. Take advantage. Wear your mask and be safe. <laughs> good night. <laughs>